So welcome back to another video and in this video we have 8 IITNs in front of me and today I'm going to challenge them with IIT JE advanced questions. So the rules of this challenge are like very simple. I'll be going to each and every one of them. I'll be asking them a subject to choose and then I'll ask them a question. And if they can answer that question, they'll be getting these freebies. Let's know who they are. Let's go. Hi, I'm Nihit. I'm from EC department. Hi, I'm Sujay. I'm from Meta department. Hi, I'm Vamsi Krishna from the department of mechanical engineering. Hi, I am Likit Kumar Surya from mechanical engineering department. I am Sanket from mechanical department. Hi, I'm Subhash from CSE department. It's me, Kesap Kosar. I'm from the physics department. My name is Matthew Manoj. I'm from the department of biotechnology. So guys, are you ready? Yes! Let's go. So here we have the questions, here we have the papers and pens, and there we have the goodies. So Deepender, you can give these papers to these people. Are you ready? Yes! Let's go! So here we have Nihit. So Nihit, which subject do you want to choose? Uh, physics. Here's your question. Note it down. Consider a body of mass 1 kg at rest at the origin at time t equals to 0. A force f is equal to... So Nihit, did you note down the question? Yeah. Yes. So how much time do you think you'll uh, take to solve this? Uh, five minutes. Five minutes, okay. Meanwhile, let's go to some other people. Let's give Nihit some time, okay? Let's go. So Matthew, which subject do you want to take? I'll take chemistry. Okay, Matthew takes te chemistry, okay? So here's your question and here's your pen. A closed tank has two compartments, A and B, both filled with oxygen. Assume to be a partition separating the two compartments is fixed. I and mean, this is one of the famous questions. If you are someone who's preparing for ITJ, you definitely know this question. Okay, this will build intense pressure inside Matthew <laughs> because it's been like two years I, I guess more than two years since he might have solved this question right and I'm a dropper too okay you're a dropper too got it so how much time do you think uh, you'll take to solve this question I'll take like 10 minutes okay let's see if Matthew will be able to solve this question or not but meanwhile let's go to the next person so here we have Vamshi so Vamshi which uh, subject do you want to choose I want to choose physics you want to choose physics okay one more guy choosing physics so here's your question sunlight of intensity 1.3 kilowatt is incident normally so Vamshi, did you did you first of all understand the question? Yes. Okay. How much time do you uh, do you think you'll take to solve this? Like around ten minutes. Around ten minutes. Okay. So let's give ten minutes to Vamshi, and meanwhile let's go to the other person. So before we move to the next guy, it seems Nehit already finished his answer. So let's see if he got a correct answer or wrong answer. Okay. Let's go. So Nehit, what is your what what answer did you get? Two Option A, B, C. Option A, B, and C. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. A, B, C. So, Nihit, your answer is wrong. The answer is A and C. A and C, okay. Fine, but but yeah, you definitely tried. So, here's your gift. Don't tell others that I'm giving, okay. even if you lose. Okay. okay. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> <laughs> Madhav, did you finish solving your question? Uh, it's still going. Okay, he's still going on. Meanwhile, let's go to the next person. Like, come on here. So now we have Likit with us. So Likit, which subject would you like to take? Maths. Okay, you're the first guy to take maths. So here's your question. The number of five digit numbers. Okay, I forgot to give the pen. The number of five digit numbers, which are divisible by four with digits from the set. So how much time do you think you'll take to solve this question? Around 10 minutes. 10 minutes, TK. So while Likit solves this question, let's go to the other person. Let's go. So Matthew, uh, how much are you done? How much time will you take? I think it'll take five more minutes. I okay. Think. Now, while he tries to answer the question, what do you do when you get stuck with the questions? I mean, if you're a JE aspirant, imagine you're studying on your own. Self-study. Whom do you ask your questions to? Now, what if I say that you can ask those questions to one of the topmost tutors in India on a one-on-one -on -one live private session in just a span of 60 seconds? There's an app called Philo which lets you do that. And this can actually make your self-study very effective. Also, you can ask unlimited questions until all of your questions are cleared. Link in the description. Definitely check it out right now. Also, yeah, did you finish the answer? Remember stepping through the club, right? So we now have Sujay with us. So Sujay, which subject would you like to take? I would like to take math. So here's your question and here's your pen. Let X be the set consisting of... So Sujay, did you understand the question? Yeah. Okay, so how much time do you think you'll take to solve this question? Around 10 minutes. Okay, around 10 minutes. So before we actually go to the next person, <clears throat> let's come back to Vamshi and ask him how much he has done with the question. So Vamshi, what's the progress? No, I can't solve it. I forgot the concepts. Got it. Got it. So Vamshi actually forgot the concept. So he is like, so do you want to give up? No, I want to try for five more minutes. Okay, that's the spirit, guys. That's the spirit. He wants to try for five more minutes. So meanwhile, let's go to the next person. Okay. So here we have Subhash. So Subhash, which subject would you like to take? 
<laughs> so Vash is like confused. <laughs> He doesn't know which subject to take. Okay, like choose randomly. Huh? Okay, math. Let's go for math again. Are you fine with math? Yeah. <laughs> he's fine with anything because he's <laughs> he's a. <laughs> <I'm> just confused. <laughs> See, this is how computer science students are. Okay. What was your AR? <laughs> AR again? 442. Okay, his AR is like 442, and he's still confused about what subject to take. So there we go. Here's your question. Here's an easy question for you. I mean, not exactly easy, but yeah. So the value of, I mean, you can just see it. So how much time do you think you'll take to solve this question? Five minutes. Okay, just five minutes. Okay, meanwhile, let's go to the other person. Okay. So here we have Sanket with us. So Sanket, which subject would you like to take? I want to go, go with physics. Okay, he's going with physics. Okay, physics, physics, physics. Let's go. Two men are walking along a horizontal straight line in the same direction. The man in front walks at a speed of one meter per second. Acha. So Subhash already finished this question. Let's let's go to him. Let's see if he's right or wrong. Okay. So Subhash, did you finish the uh, answer? Yeah. Question answer. Okay. So what is the answer that you got? Eight. Eight. Let's see if it is right or wrong. Okay. Subhash, eight. Is eight is correct. Correct answer. Okay. So here we have gifts for Subhash. Let's go. Get some. No? So here we have Keshav with us, the last person. Okay. So Keshav, which subject do you want to choose? Physics. Okay. He wants to go with physics. So here's your question. Note it down. A ring and a disc are initially addressed side by side. Are you done noting down the question? Yeah, I have done the, I have written the question, but uh, I would like to change the question. <laughs> I am not comfortable with rotation basically. Okay, he is not comfortable with rotation basically, but, but basically I was thinking that uh, any question came come, but uh, rotation part uh, <laughs> not come, then it would be better. But unfortunately, that is not possible in this challenge. That is definitely possible in JEE Advanced because you can definitely skip a question. So, do you still want to try? I will try. Uh, how much time do you think you will take? Ten minutes. Okay, Kesha would take ten minutes. Okay. Meanwhile, let's go to the other person and let's see if he has got the correct answer or the wrong answer. So, Sujay, did you finish your answer? Ah, uh, yeah, I finished. What answer did you get? Three six four eight. Is it? Three seven four eight. Sorry. Three. Three seven four eight. And three seven four eight is right, maybe. Three seven four eight is actually the right answer. Let's go. <laughs> Here's your gift and the chocolate. So I guess the remaining two people also finished their answers. Now let's go through them and check if they got the right answer or the wrong answer. Here we go. Before I give my answer, I just want to give a disclaimer. It's been a long time since I have seen the notes, so it's I don't remember the concept properly. But I think the answer is one point five. Okay. Uh. And actually, the answer is right. One point five. So here's your gift. Congrats, man. I mean, you can have obviously guess what it is. So here we have Liket with the right answer. Now let's go to Vamshi and see if he got the right answer or not. Okay, let's go. What is the answer that you got? Zero point zero one three. It's actually the wrong answer. So. <laughs> Actually, I did something with the numbers and I got something. <laughs> okay, no, no worries, no worries. Let's go, let's go, let's go. So here's your gift. I mean, you tried and that's enough. So here you go. So Sanket, did you finish your uh, answer? Yeah, I think. Okay, and what is the answer that you got? I think it is two. Uh, two is unfortunately the wrong answer. But yeah, you still tried. So let's go. Let's go to the last person right now. Let's see if he got the correct answer or wrong answer. Keshav, did you get the answer? No, I tried, but uh, some part I am missing. Got it. So as Keshav already told us, he actually forgot rotational uh, motion. So yeah, anyways, you tried. So you don't have a gift. You just have a chocolate. Okay, here's a chocolate. Here's this for you. Thank you. Finally, done. Done with all the questions. Done with all the people. So now let's see how many people actually got the correct answer and and the wrong answer. Uh, I got wrong answer. I got the correct answer. I did get the correct answer. Wrong answer. Wrong answer. Correct answer. Correct answer. I got the wrong answer. So there we go. Finally, we are done. Let's go. People are waiting. I'm shy. So the conclusion of this story is that it doesn't matter how skilled you are, it doesn't matter how talented you are. You always need to practice well in order to score well in the examination. All of these people that you have seen are toppers in the IIT JEE examination. But today, after one year, half of them gave the wrong answers. Practice is the key. So with that being said, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you liked it, and from now on, we'll make much better videos. Take care. And if you'd like to connect with me, I've given my Instagram below. Shoot me a message. Let's talk. I love you so much. Bye bye. Yo, yo, microphone check, make it a microphone check, give it a microphone, I make them make it a microphone dead. Part time shadow cat, part time, that is not a guy that I would ever wanna try to battle rap.